M0FXB, welcome back to the channel. How would you like to fill your Bofeng radio with lots of frequencies? Look on the right hand side here. Signal stick by Chris, Bofeng database. And we've got fire, marine, coast guard, PMR, all kinds of frequencies. Now I saw this demonstrated by Lewis at Ringway Manchester. So thank you very much. And so I've got my stick here, it just comes like this. And I'll show you what's inside the file. We've got the CSV file that says transmit disabled. We've got the CSV file transmit enabled, and then we've got frequencies only Excel version. Okay, so we're going to import one of these to our Bofang just using a normal Bofang UV five R cable. Now the, these will these frequencies will go in hundreds of radios. I've got several different types of Bofang, but this one is the seventeen Pro, the Bofang seventeen Pro, and we've got a normal Bofang cable just plugged in here. Now you can use one of those all-in-one cables on Amazon, they're really good, but it's a Bofeng cable plugged into my PC. So we're gonna load the latest version of Chirp, and I will put the download link in for you as well. I'll also put the purchase link for the stick. So once the radio is connected, go to download from radio, select the port, and to find your port when the cable is connected, just right click, device manager, just like so, and then double click. And there's my port, it's COM8. So we go to COM8, and then we need to find both of them. I'll test this out on a few different radios. The first one I've tested it on. So both of them, where are you gone? And it's the 17 Pro. But yeah, your older both of them, it's gonna work. 17 Pro, click yes. Now, if I what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to read from it first because I've already loaded a load of frequencies on here. But then I'm going to show you how to do it. So I'm reading from it because I want to know it works. But if you look here, this is preloaded. Yeah, you've got Bofeng, Fire, FRS, GMRS. Then you go down here to the two meter bands, Marine, Marine. You can see that it's loads PMR, PMSE, PMR, Simplex channels, 70 SEMs. It's like 500 odd channels, okay? So this is how you do it. You go file, import file, then go to the your downloads or sorry, your stick. And my stick is just here. Signal stick and then double click the one you want. Just double click here and you get the warning and then you import, of course. Make sure that you do not transmit on any bands that are illegal and just stay legal within your country. Then just write to your radio. So you go radio, upload to radio and go OK. And there you are, it's cloning to the radio, as you can see. I recommend you go to settings and tell it to display the, cha the channel because then you're going to see more well, at display type. It says frequency which is, you know, also useful, but I'm going to go the name on both. And then I'm going to write to radio again, uh, upload to radio. So, and then look at the screen of the radio once this is done. And I will enlarge that for you. And in memory mode, now on this particular one, you hold down the green button, but look, we're on the A band. So look, as we go through, you've got all the names. Marine, you can hold your finger on it, I think. And you can scroll through, you get all your Marine, or you can go to the B band. Oops. Pressing the red button on this radio. Look, but Stansted, so you've got some airports there, Oxford, all kind of stuff. And look how quick that was. Now I did watch Lewis's, you know, Lewis did this in a video and I watched that video. So I have to thank him because it saved me having to learn. <laughs> and I have to thank Chris as well for his you know, good service and backup and advice that Chris will give. And the, the sticks are about, I think they're about 12 pound delivered. And there is an airband one as well, which I'm gonna see if I can show you now. It looks like this, it's called the Flight Stick 2025. It's got all the airband. So obviously that's separate. And it says here, Flight Stick Database All-in-One by Category and you've got some notes. Both of the sticks have some, some advice for you and some technical notes. So, you know, check it out, see what you think. I'm definitely gonna do it on my Bofeng next. 
and I, I, not my Bofeng, my Quan Sheng next. Uh, so look out for that video, which I'm going to be making in about 10 minutes. The process will be identical, but you know, it's going to be nice seeing it on a Quashang. Uh, they hold so many frequencies. And nowadays you can buy ones with larger memory chips. They're going to hold more channels, aren't they? Bye for now. Thanks to Lewis, Ringway Manchester. Thanks to Chris. And 73. Hit the like, subscribe, get my wife a coffee. You know she deserves one. And uh, please join my YouTube channel, 73.